Welcome to Citing Your Research, an introduction. This tutorial is brought to you by the Research Medical Library at the University of Texas MD Anderson Cancer Center. This tutorial introduces the practice of citing your work. It defines citing, explains why we cite, and outlines what we cite. Citing is the practice of acknowledging the sources used to inform your research and writing. Writers express this acknowledgement by placing citations in the body of a paper and references at the end of a paper. Citing your work is standard practice in academic and scientific communities, and it is required by publishers when writing for publication. Citing is practiced for several important reasons. It provides a way to identify the sources we use to develop and support our hypothesis, ideas, and arguments. It credits others for their work, it lets the reader pursue information sources for analysis or knowledge development. And finally, it safeguards writers against plagiarism by making clear which ideas and words belong to others. Citations appear in the body of a paper after sentences and paragraphs. Usually, citations are constructed using names and or numbers. In the first example, the author's surname and publication year identify the source. In the next example, a number formatted as superscript identifies the source. A superscript character is set just above the normal line of type. Citations in the body of the paper correspond to complete references included at the end of the paper. A reference details a source's publication information. This example outlines publication information about a journal article. It includes author names, article title, journal name, and more. Citation style determines exactly how citations and references are constructed and displayed in a paper. Citation styles commonly used in health and medicine are covered in the next parts of this tutorial. Citations and references must be included for facts, quotes, summaries and paraphrases, and figures and images. A fact is a piece of information known to be true, like water freezes at 32 degrees Fahrenheit. Quotes duplicate the words of a source. Summaries briefly describe main points. Paraphrases restate information using different words. Figures include any graphic representation of data, like a chart, and images include any visual representation of something, like a photo. Additional information about citing your work is available from these recommended resources. You can also contact the Research Medical Library by email, phone, or live chat for help citing your work.